Hey everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. So the topic that I am going to discuss is about spoilers and speed breaks. So the spoiler uh, is basically a device found on the upper surface of many heavy and high performance aircraft. It is stored flush to the wing's upper surface. When deployed, it raises up into the airstream and disrupts the laminar airflow of the wing. So thus reducing the lift. Spoilers are basically made with similar construction materials and techniques as the other flight control surfaces on the aircraft. Often they are honeycomb called flat panels. At low speeds, spoilers are ready to operate. When the ailerons operate to assist with the lateral movement and stability of the aircraft. On the wing where the aileron is moved up, the spoilers also raise, thus amplifying the reduction of lift on that wing. On the wing with downward aileron deflection, the spoilers remain stored. As the speed of the aircraft increases, so the ailerons become more effective and the spoiler interconnect disengages. Spoilers are unique in that they may also be fully deployed on both wings to act as speed brakes. The reduced lift and increased drag can quickly reduce the speed of the aircraft in flight. Dedicated speed brake panels similar to flight spoilers in construction can also be found on the upper surface of the wings of heavy and high performance aircraft they are designed specifically to increase drag and reduce the speed of the aircraft when deployed. The speed brake panels do not operate differentially with the ailerons at low speed. The speed brake control in the cockpit can deploy all spoiler and speed brake surfaces fully when operated. Often these surfaces are also rigged to deploy on the ground automatically when engine thrust reversers are activated. So thank you everyone for watching my YouTube video. If you have any questions, you can ask me in the comment section. And don't forget to like, subscribe and share my channel. Thank you.